I have to be honest, when I first saw the toilet, I was like, what? Hey guys, it's Keegan. Welcome back to my channel. Excuse the echo. Today we are doing an empty apartment tour. I just got the keys to my apartment less than an hour ago. I am so excited to show you guys. Currently standing in it right now, as you can tell. But I'm gonna show you guys around my whole apartment. This is a one bedroom, one bath in Scottsdale, Arizona. I love this place already. I'm so excited to follow moving vlogs. I'm gonna sound like a broken record this entire video. I'm so excited. I'm so happy to be here. And I'm so excited to show you guys the whole apartment. Coming in from the front door, this is what you see. It's a little overview right here. It's so cute. Obviously, it's very echoey because there's no furniture, but once there gets furniture in here, it will not be as echoey. The lighting in here is a little yellow, so I'm planning on changing these bulbs out for maybe a little more whiter and cooler tone light bulbs. I think that will change the vibe. When you walk in, there's this little wall, but then to the left is the kitchen, and then to the right is this wall of storage. So this one right here, I can't get into. Obviously, there's part of me that like really wants to pick the lock, but I don't think that's safe. This is my water heater cooler thing right here is this is so cute What is this thing called? I used to see these all the time on HGTV when I was a kid But there's little hooks for my purses or any coats this little bench right here and then some storage down here as well as some storage up here, which is really nice. Oh, that's nice. The ceilings in here are so tall, so I can even put stuff up there if I wanted to. And then over here, we have a little coat closet. So cute. And then these doors right here go to my washer and dryer. I was going through this apartment earlier today and I found this piece of styrofoam in the washer, so I just set it there. There's also a light bulb in here, but there's so much storage above, so I need to figure out how to utilize this vertical space, but I'm really excited about it. We'll close these up. That's the front door, so this is what we just looked at. And then this way to the front door is my kitchen that I'm obsessed with. I have this nice, huge kitchen island. I'm really excited to get some bar stools and eat here. This is a brand new apartment, so all the appliances are brand new. No one's used them yet, so I'm so excited about that. I love this giant sink. I've always wanted a sink. This is so niche and random, but I've always wanted a sink that didn't have a divider, so I'm so excited about this one. And there is so many cabinets. I was thinking of putting like my plates and bowls in this one and my cups and stuff in this one probably like my silverware in here we're gonna figure out where i want to put all my stuff there will be a ton of moving unboxing unpacking organizing vlogs a nice little pantry right here i think the backsplash is so cute and then we have some more space over here that's just like my stuff that i brought here and then a nice fridge i'm obsessed with it it's so cute i was thinking that i want to get maybe some under cabinet lighting i think that would be really cool prime day is coming up so i was like oh maybe i should get some on prime day but that's right when you walk into the apartment and then where i'm standing right now is the living room so here is is the living room probably gonna put my couch on this wall my TV stand on this wall I'm a little worried that my TV stand is going to get in the way of the access to this door But I'm gonna have to measure it and we'll see and then my coffee table here I'm debating if I want to put a little desk here or put those shelves if you guys have seen my vlogs on my current apartment I have those shelves that I'm obsessed with I'm trying to decide if I want to be functional and practical and put the desk here or a desk probably a smaller desk or those shelves that I love so much. That's like my favorite part of my apartment because it's so cute. Try and decide if I want to be practical and functional or really commit to the decor idea. Let me know what you guys think. I will be measuring everything to see what I can fit and what I can't, but that's the one thing that I'm trying to debate if I should do or not. One thing that I'm so excited about, this is so random. This apartment comes with one of these things that you can hide your cords if you want to hang a TV. I don't know why I'm so excited about that. And then I have a little balcony out here, which is super cute. Love that. Adorable. I'm also so excited to get curtains. I don't know why my current apartment doesn't have any curtains, so I'm really excited to get some here. I think that's going to be really cute. All of the walls are this kind of light gray color, but in certain lighting, they look different. In the bathroom, they look almost purple, but very cute going on from the living room we have this little hallway here okay this i don't know if this is practical or not but i was considering getting a murphy desk which is like a fold up fold up desk and putting it in here i don't know if that's practical or not if i decide to do the shelves right here instead of a desk i don't know i'm trying to decide if i want to be practical or not let me know what you guys think but i saw on amazon like a desk that you can mount on the wall and then fold it up and down i don't know because there's an outlet right there but i have my thermostat right here which is really nice if i walk straight it's my bathroom to the left it's my bedroom so here is my bedroom we have a ceiling fan which is very nice for arizona there's really not much to it it's just a bedroom nice carpet 
love that probably gonna put my dresser here trying to decide if i want to bring my desk or not my bed will go here if i bring my desk most likely it would be on this wall because that's probably where there's the most space i will say i feel like this bedroom looks kind of small in person but i think that everything looks so much smaller when there's no furniture so we will see how that all works out like i said i'm gonna measure everything you guys will see that in the moving vlogs or that's probably that moving vlogs probably probably already been up but really cute love the bedroom and then to the right of that is my bathroom i'm actually so excited that i have a shower i've never had a shower in my whole life i've only ever had a tub i've never had a glass door shower so i don't know why i'm very excited about this and then i have some hooks that i was thinking of putting behind this wall and putting my towels up so it'll be nice and covered by the door but i can also reach for my towels so pretty i'm so excited to have a shower and then i'm probably gonna switch this out with my shower head that i bought from amazon there's a nice little light above it anyone know if i can change out the light bulbs in these lights i think i can but i'm not 100 percent sure yet i'm just so excited and then over here is the rest of the bathroom so there is this towel rack here which i could also use probably want to make this one more like decorative if you know what i mean and then walking in here is the bathroom Woo! or the rest of the bathroom so i have the vanity here there's some nice drawers they're pretty deep drawers it's so cool opening all these things for the first time like i've never opened these drawers before there's this little medicine cabinet here kind of small but it will fit what it needs to fit a single sink vanity there's some nice counter space i don't know if i can change out this light the only reason that i'm considering changing out the lights is because i film my youtube videos in this apartment so i want it to be the best lighting possible so if anyone has any suggestions how i can make this place very bright and not super warm toned let me know this is the toilet i have to be honest when i first saw the toilet i was like what it's a toilet but look at how you flush it like what is this this is so i haven't flushed it yet kind of nervous to try it but obviously i'm gonna have to but i saw that and i was like oh my gosh so unique so cute <laughs> and then across from the toilet this is my closet but i have a little linen closet which is gonna be really really nice there's not a ton of storage in this apartment the closet actually i take that back the closet's pretty big which i'm really excited about but i'm really excited that there is this and then going on into the closet, which I'm very excited about. Here is the closet. Oh my God, it's so big. Every time I walk in here, I'm like, wow, it's bigger than I remember it being, which I'm so excited about. There's also this little standing tall rack right here. Like I said, the ceilings go up so high, so I can put a lot of storage stuff that I don't use that often up here, but I am so excited. This is wires and stuff like that. I opened it and I was like, wait, I'll open it for you guys. I opened this and I was like, I'm scared of that. So I don't know what that is, but we'll just leave that there. But this is the closet. I'm so excited about this closet. I love this apartment so much. It's so cute. I'm very excited to figure out where I want to put all my stuff, how I want to decorate it. If I want to decorate it a little bit different than my current apartment, where I want to put all my stuff away. I am just so pumped. That is the end of my empty apartment tour. I'm going to do, or I've already done, an apartment tour of my apartment that I'm living in right now, fully furnished, everything, where I got all the stuff from. And so you guys will see a lot of that furniture and decor in here. I'm so excited. Like these are new vlog backgrounds. I cannot wait. I'm so excited for all the moving vlogs and the unpacking and organizing and decorating. I cannot wait to see you guys with me throughout the whole thing. I love you guys so much and I'll see you in my next video.